All right, everybody, Scott Free here, and welcome back to another commentary. So this is will be my first map, uh, not my first map, my first commentary with one of the new maps, which I I'm quite happy with. I must say, I like these maps. Even Salvage, uh, which I disliked at the start because I probably just kept getting it in bad games. I've come to like. I've learned how to play the map, um, and I will have a commentary after this one on Salvage which uh, I will discuss um, how I like to play Salvage and even this game here uh, this is this was the second game I had the first one was a TDM and I got as far as a 20 key 23 kill streak uh, which was quite good my fair play to uh, three guys shot down my ace 130 that was a uh, good teamwork by them so congratulations that video will be going up uh, no that video won't be going up sorry and um, this one here I thought was better so we're playing domination and I'm still trying to learn the spawns and um, the areas in these maps and how to get away. And this was like in the same game, the, the game just froze a couple of times. I think it was twice in this game, once in the last. So on domination, uh, I've I prefer to hold the C and the B flag and spawn them in A. It's easier to get them in that house there that I just shot the, your man from. But this here has a great advantage for growing, uh, throwing grenades up to uh, protect B. So if you have A and B and you're good with your Semtex, um, it's, it's an absolutely brilliant way to um, get your uh, guns uh, shots over. And here I was going for the points. I was like, oh shit, I moved away too quickly. And I lost it. So um, that guy got a lucky sticky grenade and, and killed me. So I'm not sure that's my... Uh, no, I think two or three more deaths. So there's a nice grenade, as you can see, and I, I get a buzz kill on someone, which which is good. And I see this guy behind the car, and he, he gets me. So, uh, sorry, I'm rambling on here about rubbish. What I like to do on bailout is stay in... Pick a location and stick to it. I have this game, uh, this map split in my head, mentally, in four locations. We have got this building here. Which this building here and that kind of the A spawn there, which is location one. Um, location two is the B spawn, uh, sorry the B flag. Uh, location three is the house to the left of me, and four uh, will be five. Then four is the back area near the swimming pool, and then five will be the center area. And what I do is I kind of flush uh, out each area um, as I move through the map, which seems to be the best way uh, I find to go around on this game so uh, I thought there was a guy up here and uh, one of my teammates must have got him um, god what was I going to say Boop -ba -da -ba -da. I think oh yes watch this I hear a guy here I think I can call it an AA-12 camper uh, later uh, maybe it's just going to be Neil I'm upstairs and I hear this guy so I'm waiting for him um, I think it's here is it I can't remember. Anyway, I'll keep talking. And uh, I like to flush uh, through each area. Uh, on these new maps, I'm still trying to learn, as I said, the, the spawns and the, the the spawns and the choke points in each map. And um, I I think I have salvage sorted out, so I have that one in the bag, and I do quite well on that. And why have I jumped to my AC-130? Sorry, I'm going to have to change this video. Okay, that's sorted out. I missed a I missed a clip, uh, which is quite good because this is only five minutes. Uh, there's a guy that calls me the camper, a 12 camper. And I'm like, yeah, screw you, I heard you. And this gun, I have mixed reviews about it. It's uh, it's a very good gun for uh, quick firing and quick reloading. But uh, the poor damage on it kind of uh, sucks a little bit. But uh, no, I'm using it because uh, the quicker reload point. And I think I get another nice grenade kill here, I can't remember. Uh, no, I don't, I didn't throw the grenade. So, here we're being pushed back again. This was quite a good game because uh, both teams are quite uh, repetitive. And it's always good to throw grenades and flashbangs in there. I do that a couple of times and also into the B from this area. Yeah, I find it works out nicely. Because, like I said, there's um, people learning these new, map, new maps are going to tend to uh, to camp in areas or take it easy. Uh, there won't be any rush to uh, to go around knife only. 
except uh, you know only use me blaze uh, fanboys yeah, but uh, other than that uh, it there's nothing very welcoming about it to to encourage them if you know what i mean so yeah you know i had loads of topics to talk about when i was doing this game and uh, of course when i do the commentaries i forget all about it um, I think I had a nice search and destroy game on this. Um, I think it went six and zero, oh, but I deleted it because it it got a bit boring. Um, I did quite good the first two rounds. The second two rounds, I don't. I think I got one or two kills up to so I'm not going to use that for you guys. And uh, oh, <laughs> thanks everyone for the comments on the uh, the video about my table. <laughs> um, yeah, my table's quite small. I haven't got much room, so uh, this table is all that's uh, all I'm gonna have, and it does me grand. Um, a couple of times I do run out of space for my mouse, and it gets me killed. But you learn about it. And that guy there uh, almost got me with his choy knife. He was unlucky. But like I said, I'm just going uh, taking rings around here, <coughs> um, testing the waters. Seeing how the enemy team is, uh, they don't seem to be uh, too happy to come to A, and they're just taking it easy down here. And here, I can hear a guy, and I just don't know where he is. He's moving very slowly, so I'm guessing he's crouching. And I don't know where he is, and I'm going mad here. And I heard him, he jumped down there, if you heard that. And I wasn't sure, and I didn't see him there. I checked in here, and I hear he's at A. And I'm not sure, I think this gets me my AC-130. Oh, no, it doesn't. Anyway. He gets taken out. But I've got no nuke so far in the new maps. I have it turned on. I have it unlocked. I'm using the Harrier AC-130 and nuke. I was using the Pave though, but um, I'm not quite sure about that. Um, it gets shot down uh, quite a lot. So here I was going to crouch down beside his car and I said, wait, I'm going to shoot them cars and probably kill myself. And here I heard uh, losing Alpha. And thankfully a guy spawned there to take care of that. So I came into this gym here to do my AC-130. And I can't remember if this was a good AC-130 or not. Um, I found it quite difficult to find people. I think they were camping in that building as you see there. And uh, I'm just trying to cover B there because I don't want them to capture B because then I'd feel a bit, uh, a bit too open. It's best to hold A and B uh, in this map because C is kind of down low um, it's uh, easier to capture but it's in such a location that if someone's going to try and capture it it's a long uh, long run back if it's your flag uh, from any other flag in my opinion so that was quite a worthless AC-130 um, I'm not sure what my score is and I heard this guy upstairs and I came up on the uh, UAV and I was waiting for him to come down to me but uh, he didn't want to so I came up for him and I took him out. I hear him saying, "Whoa, we've only got uh, you know a, a minute, 30 seconds left uh, in this game, so I'm trying to push forward to get them kills." And I missed that guy, so he knows I'm there. So I said, "I'll let this guy go ahead of me," and he got through quite safely. So I, uh, I said, "I'll push up." And uh, as you see, I've started to use different weapons. So I've taken up the scar now, and uh, that guy there knifed me, and. Uh, he ended my spree, but uh, I didn't, didn't seem like I was going to hit the nuke anyway, which was, would have been a pity. But uh, yeah, I've taken up the scar. Uh, I never really liked this weapon, and I'm starting to uh, get into the groove with it. So uh, I find it best with the holographic, and I find I have to aim in the upper chest to kill people. Uh, whereas other weapons, you can aim in the legs and stuff, and you get a nice kill. But uh, this one is upper chest. But it's very accurate and a great long range. It's uh, very similar to the Taurus, but slightly more accurate. But um, yeah, sorry for rambling on too much. Uh, 21, 3, and 4. Quite a good game of domination, I think. Uh, 